So we are in the Kasachi Forest, uh, looking for a place to camp. Welcome to a uh, another whiskey and cash outing. Yeah. Want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> We're uh, currently driving down a dirt road and uh, got a little ways to go. And uh, actually, we may have just missed the turn, so let me check my map. All right, we're back on track. We're a uh, pretty rough road right here, or trail, I guess. Let me see if I can turn it around and let y'all see it. I'm trying to dodge potholes as much as I can. Uh, it makes me want to throw up. <laughs> little up and down action going here. <sighs> Tired ball. A little bit. Stayed up kind of late last night since I didn't have school. <laughs> this road must not have been there before because uh, we had to go around. I don't know, maybe there was a tree down at one time right there because we just made a loop for no reason. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah, it's raining. We got here right before it started raining. We got the tent set up and we got uh, the uh, awning set up. But the storm, <clears throat> I didn't know which way the wind was blowing when I set up. And it was coming straight under us, <laughs> under the, uh, straight into us underneath the awning. So it was coming sideways. So we moved into the truck. Uh, we we're watching a little, little, uh, I don't know, some videos. Uh, it's slack enough. I look at the radar. It looks like it's going to uh, kind of do a little bit of rain off and on, uh, on until midnight. Uh, and then after that, it should clear up. Uh, we got a pretty decent camping spot. I'm probably going to have to move uh, shift tomorrow because uh, it was dark when we got here, as always. Especially right now with... Uh, the time change, it's, um, yeah, it's, uh, it was dark at 5.30, obviously. Um, I think it's only, it's almost 7 right now. Uh, we already ate dinner. Uh, so, we're, uh, just kind of chilling. As soon as the rain slacks again, it's starting to get on a little bit heavier again, but as soon as it slacks again, we'll probably be moving into the tent. Uh, I'll probably watch some movies and just uh, just chill and uh, ride out the storm tonight and then uh, do some video and some exploring tomorrow. Uh, we are camped on uh, Kincaid Lake in Kasachi. Uh, I'll, uh, I'll put a map showing exactly where we're at, possibly. Maybe somewhere close to where we're at because this is actually a really good spot. I don't not even know how good until tomorrow's uh, uh, the sun comes up. But um, when the lightning flashes, it lights everything up and it looks it looks like this is going to be pretty awesome in there. Uh, but I am a little uneven. Uh, I parked on some uh, some logs trying to even up the truck, uh, but. Made the chair go because the water was the, the rain was coming in. I mean, sideways at us, so that's why we moved inside uh, inside the jeep to eat our dinner. Um, and then, uh, like I said, we're gonna watch a few videos and then uh, see what the rain does. If we can, we'll come back outside and get under the awning. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. There's, like I said, the weather looks on the radar map. It looks like it's going to uh, uh, move over us and then uh, 
die out and then come back, there will be another, a second band following, I should say. Um, but I didn't have time to get my tarp set up. I could have set it up to block, but uh, it was just, the rain hit us too quick. So, but we'll get a uh, camp set up really good tomorrow. Um, the, uh, whoever was here before us brought a bunch of firewood up here or potential firewood, we need to split it and uh, process it, but um, now it's getting rained on, hopefully it doesn't get too wet, uh, we can dry it out tomorrow, uh, and then uh, have a campfire tomorrow night, we had not had one yet this year, uh, so we'll see, we'll see what's going to happen, it's Friday evening, we got, we'll be here till Sunday, and uh, we'll just see how it goes. Maybe I can catch a shot of this lightning when it flashes. Wow, talk about timing. I don't know if that showed up well or not, but we catch one more. <clears throat> it's not a good mile away, I'd say. That was about a five count. Oh, I do want to say this too. Um, I've got to figure out what to do here. Don't like this gap the, between the tent and the awning. I need to figure something out just to close that up. I mean, it's just you can be under the awning. It's a big, pretty big awning, and uh, I think it's six by eight, which is plenty big enough. But it uh. But it's got that big gap right there, and water, so water is dripping on 360 degrees around you when you're sitting under here and it's raining. So I'd like to figure something out with that. Uh, if I had time, I could have put a tarp up there and uh, tarped it out, but obviously, like I said, we got here just before the rain, and uh, it was starting to fall as I was setting everything up. So. Uh, hopefully, we'll get everything set up proper tomorrow. Um, but I don't think it's supposed to rain anymore after the night, so we should have a pretty good weekend. I didn't set out to be the uh, the guy who camps in the rain all the time. I mean, there's plenty of guys in channel to do that, but uh, I'm the guy who camped every weekend, and uh, <laughs> either I just deal with what we got, you know. Uh, you know what they say as a boy scout be prepared right you gotta, uh, be prepared for everything so uh you know we're good we've got rain gear i've got wet weather gear cash has his wet weather gear um like i said we're gonna sit in the truck and just watch some videos and then uh climb up in the tent maybe watch a movie or something but uh all right we'll we'll catch y'all later maybe in the morning maybe with breakfast
eyeball you up. Oh, everything's wet this morning. We still got a fire going. It's not that bad. We got about 40 degrees this morning. You see the water boiling out of that wood. to get up so he can help me. That's probably why he's sleeping late. He don't want to help me. That's all right. No way to drive down there. Pretty, pretty steep bank. We're on top of a hill. I guess I could cut up some more wood. So, Cash Man. Yes, sir. What'd you just have for the first time in your life? Spam, and it was delicious. Spam, huh? It was amazing. You love it? Love it. We're gonna have some Spam and eggs this morning. Mm. Forgot to bring butter. As y'all know, I always forget something, and butter was what I forgot this time. We also forgot bait. 
Oh yeah, and we forgot the bait for the fishing pole. So we can't fish. But at least we can enjoy the scenery. That's right. We're gonna hike down to the uh, to the lake here in a little bit after breakfast. And uh, go check it out. It looks beautiful from here. It does look pretty. Probably gonna be even more once we get closer to it. Are we, gonna, are we gonna eat the rest of that spam? Huh? Are we gonna eat the rest of that spam? Yeah, I'm gonna spam? cook it all. Yes, sir. Unless you wanna save it. You want me, there's a Ziploc if you wanna save it. No, we don't have to save it. Okay. I was just asking because I would have eaten it just now. <laughs> Wait till you taste it fried. God, it's fried. Yep, it's so good. Doesn't that get rid of all its nutrition? Uh, I don't know. But it tastes good when it's cooked. It's better It's better than bacon, in my opinion. <laughs> when I tried it, <laughs> I, it was better than bacon. Yeah, but you ate it raw. When you eat it fried, oh my goodness, it's so good. Sometimes you take it, you can take your spam and you cube it into little cubes, just mm -hmm. cut it all up into little cubes and fry it with your eggs. Oh, it's real good. Delicious. Oh, it is delicious. It is delicious. It's like baking bits, but with a little bit more pork and other types of meats. I think it's kind of weird that people look down on spam, but those are the same people that eat hot dogs. <laughs> yep. Like, ain't that a little bit hypocritical? I think so. Spam has six ingredients, while um, hot dogs have over 15. Ooh, yeah, that one's good. Ooh, we got some Spam! Oh, it's gonna be good. I've never been so excited to eat something. <laughs> Except when I first time tried SpaghettiOs. SpaghettiOs are pretty good, I will admit. But Chef Boyardee is 10 times better. Well, Chef Boyardee nutrition. don't make SpaghettiOs? No, they do, but I'm oh. just saying, they... No, wait, no, they don't. They don't make SpaghettiOs. Oh, really? Chef Boyardee, I think, is a different company that makes their own products. But... God, they do. They do make a spaghetti dish. My professional opinion, yes, professional. I think that. Professional eater? Yes, I'm a professional eater. Um, I think that Chef Boyardee has way more variety than some spaghetti. I also like to eat defrosted hot dogs sometimes. No, you put defrosted, sir. Defrosted? No, I mean like, like I'll take some hot dogs from the fridge and just eat them. Oh, raw hot yeah. dogs. Raw meat is just good, except raw bacon. Yeah, but uh, what you call it? Hot dogs aren't really raw. They've been uh, uncooked so for a little bit. That's what holds them together. Junk, but it's tasty. It's 
You hear that? You hear that spam crying? Is that the term that we use? Wheezy? No, crying. I don't know, I'm just saying it. Why don't you lay a couple of more logs on the fire real quick? Can you just say you want to throw some logs? Yeah, lay, don't throw them. You gotta like, lay them like a teepee. I'm getting better at it. I'm getting better at talking to the camera. Now, last week when I was at the uh, campgrounds in public, in I public, yeah, I couldn't do it. I was, I tried. I did. It, it just, nah, I couldn't do it. Yes, I, I have some respect and also just how do people do that? Yeah. Yeah, I was watching some videos at the at SEMA, which is a big automotive show, aftermarket automotive show that they do in Vegas every year. Yes. One day we'll go. Uh, but the guys walking around basically with what, with their camera and their and their selfie stick or whatever you want to call that thing. And uh, they're walking around just talking in, in front of all the people, just talking into the camera. And I mean- just, I couldn't do that. Yeah, I, I mean, it. it but the thing is, I guess it's so common now that the people that are in the background, they're not even paying attention to them. You know, it's not, they don't care. So, I mean, I guess I shouldn't either. The sun's trying to come out. But we got a bunch of trees. I can't believe what? didn't want to go camping? I can't believe it's simple. Oh. You're talking about last week when you said that? Yes, sir. Nah. That's the thing. I know that when you get out here, you'll have fun. That's why I make you come. <laughs> Even though you're sitting around going, eh, I don't really feel like going camping. And then every time we come out, Just have fun. we have a good time. Besides, I play, I go up into the tent and I play a little something on, on the electronics. That's exactly what I do at home. Except now I'm doing it outdoors. I'm such a pro dad. I'm a professional. I wouldn't say you're a pro professional. I think you're a professional or a pro. Which one do you rather be? I'd like to be both. Okay. So you want to be a professional pro? Yep. Well, I want to be a professional. Oh, I cannot wait to feast in. Scrambled eggs? Yeah. Who doesn't like a bunch? 
when it's blowing the smoke's in that direction. Yeah, it's kind of where it's swirling. Uh, all right. Yeah, I'm so happy that you got me a chair. Got I, a chair. I got myself a chair, so I won't steal yours anymore. Well, it's your money. Oh no, come on, it's all clogged up. Chef Shishire. 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 Tony Shishire. 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 However you say that. Tony Shishire. 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 This one don't even say Shishire. Maybe it says on the other side. Shishire. 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 It's Tony Shishire. Tony Shishire. Tony Shishire. Riola seasoning. You know what, Dad? What, son? Son, can we have the crawfish boil? Like little jades and crawfish boil? Crawfish coming. I can't wait for that. <laughs> it's going to be good. I might go to the store for now on because I used, to, I used to go to the store like get on the bike go to Walgreens or the gas station and I'll get some SpaghettiOs or Tony no um, Chef Boyardee but now when I go to the store I'm going to get spam you're going to get some spam? because I do sell spam almost everywhere and luckily they usually have full shells I really don't understand why people don't like spam. I don't know. We ought to buy some more because it keeps forever. You just have it. Yeah, doesn't spam like feed starving people? Mm -hmm. heard, I don't know. I've heard there's like countless food drives where it's filled with spam. Because we've done food drives. Isn't that right? Yeah. And like, didn't I you think... see some spam? Oh, yeah. I think we have another one coming up. Are y'all doing a food drive at your school? Um, I don't think so. Hmm. I know we normally do a food drive at your school and then we go with the big truck and go load it up. You remember that? Mm -hmm. Every last three Thanksgivings we've loaded up the truck at your school and, uh, and bring it to, uh, to Miss, Miss Kay's house. She's uh, in charge of uh, Brennan's Blessings. Mm -hmm. Well, And they feed they feed families that uh, of cancer patients. Either the parents might have cancer and they can't afford because uh, they're paying for medical bills, or they'll uh, the kids will have a child has cancer and it helps the parents out for Christmas and Thanksgiving. That's why we do the toy drive and the food drive. Well, did we do one last year? Mm -hmm. Yeah, remember we. I would get in the line yes, sir. Yes, sir. and unload all the uh, all that food. I'm really glad I got you as a father. Thank you. All right. <laughs> No, sir. I'm excited. Oh, excited? <laughs> I don't get too, too cold. 
Thanks, Dad. You're welcome. Why do you do that, Dad? Do that. What? Beat it on my knee? Just get the leaf out of it. Ah. <laughs> First, I'm going to try the spam. There's a bunch of family YouTubers. Yeah. And I don't, I just don't like that. I put their lives on the internet for fun. All right. All right. Please. Cash was just about to try cook spam, and then the battery died on a camera. It was delicious. <laughs> So good. Yep. Mm. Uh. <laughs> Since it was Veterans Day yesterday, mm -hmm. thank God they fought in the war so I can enjoy this. How proud I am to be an American. That ain't no joke. You want anything to drink, Dad? No, I got coffee. You need some water? Yes, sir. I'll let you some. Oh, got it? Yes, sir. Hey, grab me a yogurt and you a yogurt. We'll have a yogurt that, after. That's what I was about to do. We'll have a yogurt for for breakfast, I mean for vanilla, uh, strawberry, blueberry. No, the vanillas are yours. Okay. Strawberry, blueberry. Either one, don't matter, whatever you see. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, no problem. <clears throat> Funny if I just got the other forgot. Forgot to get the water. Yogurt. Excuse me. There wasn't anything, anything in there. But there's a little bit of it. I meant so you, would, you could use it for your water. Yes, sir. Spam and eggs, baby. Spam and eggs. Good stuff. For sure. This was live, I, would, I guess I would say. You should spam. Spam. Spam, spam. Spam, spam. Vanilla with other natural flavors. Dad. Yes, sir. Have you ever had like the weirdest food combination? Like my mom used to—I I hated it when I was a kid, but I like it now. But my mom used to put a uh, uh, cottage cheese mm. with uh, the fruits. <laughs> that sounds good. Good. I, I didn't like it when I was little, but I, I like it now. With the good old, with some apple slices, especially. Ooh, man, that would be, yeah. Okay. Cottage cheese is just good. Cheese is just good. Cheese is just good. Thank, thank the Lord that I am not. That's what you ought to do. Like I do a whiskey and camping, you ought to do a cheese channel. <laughs> and just try different cheeses. Uh, if I had, if I had the money, <clears throat> if it was summer and I, <clears throat> dang, smoke it was, in your face. Yes, sir. If it was summer and I had 
an opportunity to go mow lawns, I would do that. And just spend the money on cheese? Yes, sir. Pretty much. <laughs> probably some other stuff. Like, actually, you know, probably just cheese. I don't really got anything else in it. Cheese and Roblox. Roblox. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out how to code. So with that money I might make from the summer going, I probably could um, purchase an online class because I got some. Because on those YouTube sponsorships that I watch, like I watch these people on YouTube and they have sponsorships called Skillman. Mm -hmm. It's like you pay for certain classes. Yeah, I think that's pretty cool. Yeah, I saw another uh, another sponsored video where they had something. It wasn't skill made, it was something else. But they do the same thing. They have classes. What is this, Dad? Mm-hmm. Mm. I think I'm going to name the video. Spam. My name it. Spam and eggs. Cash discovers spam. Well, uh, it's my new favorite food, Dad. I need to my coffee. New favorite food. Hmm. Actually, still my favorite food of all time. Must be Chef Boyardee um, mini raviolis. But this, if I don't got Chef Boyardee, then I'll just get some raw, raw Spam and then eat it. If I was at Mom's though, she has an electric stove, not a gas stove, so it's kind of more safer for me to use it. Probably cook with some Spam. Mm. That was good. That was good. Dang. Have me a little dessert. Activia. It's best yogurt around. Your plate's also good. Yeah, your plate is really good. But this just has more fiber. This is better for your gut. That's exactly what I'm about to say. Dad, huh. I bet you I can drink this with my hands. I know you can. I'm about to do it. <laughs> the skill. That's one of those practice. strange skills. Another strange. I tried to do that. I tried to do that with him. I almost drowned. <laughs> he beat and, me. And I want a Butterfinger. Um, I want a Butterfinger ice cream that night. Except we didn't go and get it that night. Mm. I think we got it the next night when we were going camping. We're doing something that. We were doing something that weekend. So how how's this camping spot rank on the epic scale? <laughs> Obviously, the at most the best one was uh was up in Arkansas on the river. No doubt. So what about compared to where we stay at the river? Uh, last time. Uh, like you and me? Yeah, when we both when we stayed the river. Then I have to say that I think this one's better. You think this one's better than the, the one we stayed at by the river? Yes, sir. Because, like, it's both open and closed. Well, that one I just felt a little bit closed. Mm. Also, 
I have to give the points on the spam because it's sort of like... <laughs> the spam but, made the trip, huh? Yes, sir. Here, we have to move camp get this thing more leveled. I was rolling on top of cash last night. <laughs> yeah, I should have sat right there and you sat right there. Um, we got here late. It was dark, so we couldn't really see to get this thing leveled up, so. Now that we do have more. Yeah, now light. that we got light, we can, uh, yeah. So I think if I put that tire in that hole, that's what I was trying to do last night. I think it'll level it this away. Yeah, so if you do put that tire, I, I'm really concerned about that. Yeah. Because we mostly need the back side to be Yeah, exactly. Your gloves. gloves. I'm sitting on them. Oh. I'm sucking. You want to try these gloves? They won't be as bulky. I'm fine, Dad. You sure? Mister, those are your gloves. Mm -hmm. Those are my gloves too. <laughs> you want to try? Them? I don't know why I took off both of them. These are, uh, these are, uh, what you call it? Fire uh, No, uh, touch screen. Oh. Touch screen gloves. So you can stay cool and operate. Check your screen. phone and stuff, yeah. Well, and, uh, they're comfy. I'll do this. Yeah, they're good for uh, like keeping your hands warm and you still use your phone or your GPS or whatever. When I go hiking, use those, I use those gloves so I can check my GPS or take photos or whatever. For Christmas, can I get some hiking boots so we can go hiking? Yeah. Thanks, Dad. You want your gloves back? Mm -hmm. Alrighty. <laughs> my outfit's all out of shape. What do you mean? I've got black pants. It's blue. Black pants, white shirt, red pants. Are you comfortable? I am. It doesn't matter. It don't matter as long as you're comfortable. Thank you. Hey, grab that branch right behind you. Just reach up there and grab it. It's going to fall down on your head anyway. It's not attached to nothing. There you go. <laughs> Looked up there. Like, oh, that's going to fall on Cash's head. <laughs> it would have been funny if, if it did fall. Yeah. When we go down there, we'll, we'll uh, look for some more... Uh, Look for some more kindling. Well, don't throw it all away. Throw it over there so we can stack it up. Yes, Get us another fire tonight. Yes, sir. That camp is pretty high up there. We're way up on a hill. Sure, yeah. <laughs> That's pretty. 
It's not pretty. The trash? Yeah. Yeah, people litter. Beautiful landmarks. Oh, is this a landmark? Sure. This is a. Uh, this is Lake Kincaid. It's beautiful. Um, this is the lower part. The upper part is a reservoir. Uh, I think there's a spillway. There's probably a dam where they let it fill up with water, and uh, you know that's the water for the area. Well, if it was summer, you know what I would be doing. What's that? Swimming. Swimming. You have to find a place to get in where you would be. Uh, you wouldn't have to walk through all this crap to get in. Suffer from probably snakes. Yeah. Snakes. It's cold. Oh, it's cold. There's no snakes now, but during the summer, I imagine there's probably a bunch of snakes. Look, let's grab some of this firewood right here. Carry that back up with us. Yeah. Yeah, those are good pieces right there. That's perfect. Saw some other pieces over here. We'll grab. Isn't it called the fire triangle? Like oxygen, heat, oxygen, fuel, fuel, and heat. Ooh. Right about 30 minutes to kick off. Unless you uh, in Arkansas. Kind of suck to come off a big win and get uh, rewarded with a uh, 11 a.m. kickoff in the snow. I think it's snowing up there in Arkansas. Anyway, uh, kind of keeping the fire going. We had a little mishap. Uh, I had walked away from cat camp to do my business, and uh, Cash got up and went to the truck in his uh his brand new chair or his chair there's my brand new chair but his chair is uh is gone but he was pretty down about it but uh I told him don't let it ruin our trip Lesson learned. Uh, got to stay. Somebody's got to stay by the fire. If you have a fire going, it needs to be attended. So, uh, like I said, lesson learned. Not that big a deal. Uh, I'm gonna look around for another one. See if I can find it. I may have to order it online. Uh, but like I said, lesson learned. Well, tires did it again. <laughs> it was close. But uh, they still come away with a win. 13, 13, 10, I think. So, uh, it, it wasn't pretty, but it was still a win. So, anyway, we're walking down here to go see Cash. What's Cash doing down here? What am I doing, Cash? <laughs> What are you doing? Down here at the water. Oh. Boy, it's steep. This is a steep hill. I agree. Very steep. Kind of slick, too, with all these leaves. So the lake over here we got this cut here I don't know if this is a creek or what's going on oh gunshot look at that beautiful tree right there though what that one yes sir. that's a cypress tree I think it's pretty neat how it's like <laughs> 
just hold on. in the middle of the hold water. Hold on. You what? Say again? It's neat how it's in the middle of the water. Yeah, cypress trees grow where it's very wet. <sighs> yeah. It's beautiful. It's pretty cool. So you know where all that stuff is hanging off of it? Yes, sir. Do you know what that is? No, sir. I do uh, not know what it is. That is Spanish moss is what that's called. Does it decompose? I, I don't think it de decomposes at all. I think it just, it grows. It's kind of a symbiont. So it's just something that you can tell is a cypress tree? Uh, actually, it'll grow on other trees. Like that tree? So that is an oak tree. And it has Spanish moss growing on it. Um, I, it is a... Uh, I think it may be a, a air travel thing. I'll have to look that up. So yeah, this little cut goes back pretty good ways. You want to hike down there? We can. Let's see where it goes. Huh? Let's see where it goes. I don't want to leave the fire unattended for too long. Let's not go far then. Because we already learned my lesson. Well, I learned my lesson. Did you show everybody it? I did show everybody our lesson. Whoa, shit. Woo! I'm going to that with you. See if you can walk it. Exactly. All right, here we go. So this must be a dead tree. Very dead tree. Can he do it? Can he do it? You're cheating. You can't grab anything. Hey, it's nature. <laughs> can he do it? I don't know. I don't know if he can. And his son, you're supposed to encourage me. I'm not encouraging or discouraging. You're neutral? <laughs> I'm just seeing if you can do it. You think I'd want to walk a little bit further? Keep going. That's enough. furthest enough? Far all right. Enough. Did good. All right, so here it is. There's the end of it. So it's not a stream. It is a, uh, it's just a little cut. So there's a berm here that ends it. Do you think this would make any good firewood? It would, but I'm not carrying a log. I will. You're gonna carry that whole log back up to the fire? Oh, that one. No, it's got green on it. It ain't gonna grow. I mean, it ain't gonna burn. Only the only dead stuff. So we got a berm here. Although the creek may go right, right there. It might keep going. Walk out on that berm and see. Where? That berm right there. See if you walk that berm and see if there's water on the other end of it. See so how these are all cypress knees. So this is 
the way the roots do on a cypress tree is they're always trying to grow up. They're That's always trying to make new trees. So all these cypress knees right here. Those are soaking those, up water? They're going to grow into trees eventually. And what? all these right here come from this tree here. All right. So yeah, more water. Got a little cut right here. Oh, look at, look at the water running right here. Some water running? See the water running? It's oh. running down. This might be the stream. This might be the um, creek that we were talking about. Like from those other camp spots you marked on Gaia. Yeah. Not sponsored. This is probably from that rain last night though. Possibly. Probably some overflow from that rain. Looks a little bit natural though. Beautiful sight, isn't it? I'm not talking about the sight that's going on behind me. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a little trickle. Not his trickle, but this trickle. <laughs> Yeah, so you definitely tell the water's flowing that away. So, water's coming out of the woods right here and flowing down to the lake. I want to see if I can? Yeah, go ahead. See if you can get across that creek. You got your rubber boots on. Don't let the water go over your boots. Look, step on those cypress knees right there. There you go. Perfect. Let's head back. Here comes Cash. Check out the bark on this tree. I don't know what kind of tree that is. I've never seen any bark like that before. Look how it's like a, it's like dragon scales or something. That's pretty trippy. Very cool. Uh, looking at the leaves, I would think that that's some kind of oak, but I would have to look at it, look at it up and uh, see what that is. I think it is dead though. No, nah, look at the green leaves. The leaves look like oak leaves. And look, there's Spanish moss growing on it, way up there. Do you see the Spanish moss? Look at that spider. What? Look at that humongous spider. Where? Oh, check him out, the spider. Yeah, it peeled off bark, expecting to see something cool. So this spider was underneath the bark that Cash pulled off. Very neat. Check him out. Let's see what he does. He must be in like hibernation mode. I think we should leave him be then. Oh yeah, we definitely leave him be. Are. All right, see how far I can walk? Yes, sir. Are you going to cheat like me? My dad's so cool. Nope. You didn't have to cheat. I made it further than you, though. Well, I mean, I could have held on to the tree and kept going. I made it further. That's all that matters. <laughs> Ow. You're able to interact with nature way more when it's winter. Thank you. You're able to interact with nature way more when there isn't, when, while it's winter. Why do you think? Because like, there's not too many dangers, like snakes hanging oh, like from snakes. trees. 
spider's ready to bite you. What type of spider do you think that was? I don't know. I don't know much about arachnids. Here we are. Oops. So Cash is trying to climb up this tree. It's down. It's half rotten. He's trying to make it up. What's your goal? Make to the branch? Make it to that branch, right there. That's your goal? No further. Cause... No further? Okay. Yeah, we're gonna burn that later. Whoop. He's almost got it. What do you reach out? Let me see. Oh man, you're only like two foot short. Two foot short of that branch. You got it, dude. Scoot. You got to scoot. So all you can do is scoot. There's no big movements. There you go. You got it. Scoot. There you go. Come on, you almost got it. You almost got it. Got the branch. All right, claim victory. Get up there and claim victory. No. You got to claim victory. All the way up there? No, you got to claim victory on that branch. Oh. So you got to stand up. All right. Say no. <laughs> on my casket, be flat. <laughs> you don't need a casket. Two arms in the air, claim victory! Victory! <laughs> Good job, dude. Thanks, Dad. Now for the easy part. <laughs> Alright, video me. <laughs> no. Are you gonna try it? All right, where's the first aid kit, just in case? Look at my dad. How do I zoom in? Look at you, dad. Gonna try and attempt it? Huh? Gonna try and attempt going further? Yeah. All right. So this is the trail we came in last night. The sun came out finally. Finally the sun has shown itself. Here comes the sun. Na 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 na. Here comes the sun. And I say, it's all right. You think it is all right? Oh, oh. Do you actually think it's all right? The sun, yeah. <laughs> what about So, <laughs> we almost came down this. But we ended up coming down this. Which was a much better option so we had parked here we were going to stop here and we were going to camp and i got out and i walked 
like the rest of the better. trail and was like oh no we're not we're not staying here so we'd actually stopped here and i said let me walk down the trail and so i walked down the trail chose a good decision what's that chose a good decision. made a good decision yes sir walked down a little further came back up and drove on down found a great spot cash agrees oh i definitely do this is certified improvement uh, uh, certified uh, approval certified approval of cash the dude <laughs>